Welcome back to Soda City Live. Painting with a twist is a fun experience anytime you want to get creative, but you can paint with a purpose with a few events that are going to be coming up soon. Joining us today is Kathy Lane. She is the owner of Painting with a Twist in Columbia, and we're so excited to have her joining us today to thank tell you. us about these amazing images that you're seeing around us today. But Kathy, thank you so much for joining us. Well, thank you for having me. I'm so excited. You know, one of the most important things is if you're a business, you need to give back to your community. Mm -hmm. And we're local and we like to give back. So we do all these events. They're called Painting with a Purpose. We work with 501c3s. Uh, and then what we do is we put on a party. So we're going to do this one on Sunday at two o'clock. This is for Make-A-Wish. So you'll come in, you'll paint, and then $20 of every seat goes back to the organization. Wow. So we're very excited about that. And we've got multiple so this one is coming up. This is Humane uh, Society, and I that one's it. coming up in May, okay. which is very Van Gogh exciting. experience. Yes, yes. You know. And our artists walk you step by step yeah. through. You can bring beer, wine, or champagne to enjoy. No bring hard your alcohol. Own bottles? Oh yes, yes. oh yes. And then uh, you can bring little nibbles, and we're going to walk you step by step through. Even if you have never painted, you're going to be amazed at how talented you are. And so it's a lot of fun, and then it's for a good cause. We put the fun in fundraising. So one of the most important ones to us, uh, we work with Vera Bradley. We've been seven years with them uh, for their Breast Cancer Foundation. Uh, I lost my very best friend uh, in 2019 to so sorry, triple negative yeah. stage four. Thank you. Yeah. Uh, her name was Jamie, and so I painted this painting. This is the one that we're going to be doing in October. And so we donate back to Vera Bradley, the foundation, uh, and they do specific research for uh, the type of cancer that my friend had. And uh, we recognize survivors uh, and we just support one another because I think everybody knows at least one person yeah. who's suffered from breast cancer and it's really important that we keep that research going Absolutely. so and we have a lovely time and then uh, this one coming up we actually work with Riverbank Zoo uh, we've worked with them probably the last six years and so the American Association of Zookeepers they come to us and this is actually going to be uh, donated for trees so it's a tree for you and me and so they're gonna do that we're we're going to paint that painting and we're going to Bob Ross it up. Uh, okay. Uh, and little. you can add fun <laughs> things. Uh, even though we're painting that, uh, we've had people add the Death Star. Uh, we've had people um, add little animals. Uh, we had Godzilla in a Not painting. The Death Star. Oh, yeah. No, don't do that. Yeah, but, you know, it's really <laughs> yeah. fun because we really want folks to really uh, be creative and right. add their own little touch. Yes. And so that's some of the fun things they do. I love it. And I'll tell you, I've been to painting with a twist before. I learned how to paint a door outside, like a Charleston door. Mm -hmm. And I was like, yes, I have skills. Mm -hmm. you didn't, I didn't know it. No one knew it. And I, <laughs> I messed up a few times. And speaking of Bob Ross, I had some little happy accidents to fix up, but they, they looked intentional. Um, but I want to ask, so if anyone wants to specifically sign up for those sessions mm -hmm. that are painting with a purpose, how do they, how are they able to distinguish those between the other painting classes that you all offer? So when you go to our website, there's a the page that says events. Mm -hmm. You can do a drop down uh, little menu and it'll say painting with a purpose and it's going to show every one of those. And if you have a specific one that you love that's near and dear to your heart, you just click that and you register. Um, and if you want, you can have a girls night out yeah. or date night for all of these and they're a lot of fun. And you never know how talented you are until you try, as you know. Absolutely. I, I have a hallway filled with the creations I never knew I could create. <laughs> Um, and again, tell our viewers how they can get in touch with you and, and talk a little bit more about the, the process. So when they come in, you all offer smocks. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. They have everything you need is there. Just bring your bottle and your body. Yeah, exactly, <laughs> exactly. So when you walk in, we're going to have everything prepared. Yeah. We have the most beautiful studio. It's sparkly clean. We don't have paint on the floor. There's nothing splattered. We're going to give you an apron to protect your clothes, although we encourage you not to wear evening wear, although we've had people do that. It's yeah. very exciting. Uh, but you can come in, and we're going to walk you step by step through. Bring your favorite bottle of wine, beer, champagne. We don't do hard alcohol because that changes the painting. Yeah. Uh, and not in a good way. And a person. Yeah, yeah, exactly. <laughs> and so. So uh, we have a great time. We listen to great music. Most of our guests sing. Uh, there's some bad dancing. That's me. Uh, and then at the end of the evening, you walk out with your own masterpiece. And Beautiful. it's great fun. And knowing that the proceeds from the event you attended is going towards a great cause. Yes, it's very important. And, and again, we like to support uh, local and, and our wonderful uh, charities. They're, they're very important to all of us. Awesome. And for this class happening this weekend, um, is it filling up? Is it filled? Yes, or? but we still have seats. Okay. So go ahead and visit. register. This is 
use for ages 12 and above. Oh, awesome. And there's going to be some opportunity for finger painting. Oh. So who doesn't like that? Listen, you got you to gotta use all your tools to get the art across. <laughs> Look at your screen right there. We have details. Again, this is going to be happening on Sunday, St. Patrick's Day. Make sure you wear your green. You're going to get pinched. It's from 2 to 4. She, uh, As Kathy mentioned, ages 12 and up. And then in April, there's going to be an event happening with the Riverbank Zoo, uh, the American Association of Zookeepers. That is an adult event, so keep the kids 18 and under at home. <laughs> And there's also going to be an auction um, for that one this year uh, created by their animals. Talk about that. Oh, my gosh. So they always come up with the most wonderful things. We have a silent auction. Yeah. And so there are snake paintings where they take the huh. snake and it just kind of wiggles across a canvas. Uh, we've had um, their monkeys do little cards. Oh um, it's very, very popular. Uh, I think we had... Uh, one of their giraffes, I'm not sure. But we we have all sorts of little animals that they do. Animal art. And they're, they're so it. much fun. They're so much fun. So we, that's another way to give back yeah. uh, to the zoo. And, and it's a light. That's Beautiful. a lot of fun. And there's one more event I want to make sure we get before we wrap up today. April 7th. Um, I believe. Is it April 7th? That's May. That's May. Okay, so this one is in May, the Humane Society. We, we touched on that one, but when is that one going to be happening? Okay, so Humane Society is May 9th. Uh, that's a Thursday night, 6 to 8. That is another adult event, so 18 plus, beer, wine, champagne, welcome. And we're going to lead you through this. And you know what? You don't even have to do a dog. So this is a dog, but you could do your cat. Uh, maybe you have a pig. I don't know. I don't judge. But whatever mood you're in, you can put your little animal there yeah. and have a great time. And you have this wonderful Van Gogh-esque. Yep, absolutely. Well, uh, Kathy, thank you so much for joining us, telling us about these amazing opportunities for people to paint with a purpose. We're going to take a quick break. We'll be right back. We'll have more when we return. Stick with us.